touchdown. Oh boy, that A3 is going down. Okay, so last night, one of you guys told me to play an online flight simulator, like, you know, in your browser. So, I was like, what? Because, to be honest, I actually didn't even know, like, that existed. There's apparently flight sims you can play in your browser. So I figured, let's just try some of them out and see how they work. So, the first thing that pops up is GOFS, the free online flight simulator. I guess we could try that one. We'll see how many we can do today, but we'll, we'll begin with this one, because it seems like like the the main one so to say so let's uh let's see how it works okay so now we're in did i just <laughs> that's an a380 wait is this like online there's a lot of planes spawning in right now um either way i figured we could try out some of the bigger aircraft so let's begin with a 737, that's like the most basic one. So this is the 737, it's a KLM, you seem to control the plane with your mouse, you see if I move the mouse, everything like moves around, so that will be interesting. Okay, here's a cockpit view, this actually looks better than I thought. Okay, so to take off now, we, we're gonna need to add some thrust, uh, the thing is I don't know how to increase throttle plus, okay, there's a Concorde in this. uh oh. Is it really safe to take off here? So let's add some thrust here and let's see how this will go. Oh boy, what's... Oh, wait, am I... Why is my plane doing a wheelie? Um, yeah, can, can we like pull up? There we go. Okay, so how do you retract the gear then? Um, G? Oh, okay, that makes sense, I guess. Okay, so now we're in the air. Uh, the scenery is, you know, it's, it's certainly not the best scenery I've seen, but you know, it... It's an online flight simulator. This plane is actually way better than I expected though, because it has like reflections and everything. Very high tech stuff, you know? Okay, so I figured, uh, let's just try to land a plane. So we're gonna have to turn around here and go back to the airport. This is not a bank angle, by the way, it's fine. Now we're lined up here. Uh, oh boy, the runway is kind of far down. Let's put the gear down and let's go into the third person view. Okay, okay, this works. Oh wow, look at this, like, it's so sensitive. Okay, let's straighten up the plane and let's just try to land. This is gonna be a tough one. Oh, no. <laughs> that's, that's not what I meant to do. Uh oh, we're gonna run out of runway. Come on. Who is calling me in the middle of my landing? Okay, okay, we're down, we're down. Um, oh, I already have the thrust versus house. Okay, how do you break? Um, B? No, that's the spoilers. Okay, let's check the, the, the controls real quick. Uh oh, we're going down. Frick. We're on the grass, we're, <laughs> we're spinning around, okay. There it is. Now we can just taxi to the gate. There doesn't seem to be like any airports though. You, you can't like taxi anywhere, I guess. So let's try a new aircraft. We got a lot of things here. We got Cessna, we got the A380. That's something I want to try. So let's try the A380. So we spawn in here. It's very dark. Let's check out the cockpit. So here is the A380 cockpit. It's not as detailed as the 737 one, but I mean, it, it works. It would work, you know. Okay, so another thing I noticed is that you can choose a location here so let's choose an approach let's try to approach st martin okay do you think that will work with an a380 let's find out can you land an a380 at st martin in your browser okay so gear out so let's line up here let's look at the cockpit actually let's have this outside view uh oh come on that's not okay i mean that works let's just enable the thrust reversers spoilers out and full brakes we don't want to hit this plane in front of us. You know what? It's your decision to go in front of an A380. This is what happens. Oh boy. <laughs> Poor 737. Oh no, I think we're going off the runway. Yeah, we are. Pull up, pull up. Hello? Pull up. No, not the ocean. So that's the GOFS flight simulator. Let's try, let's try something else. Let's go back here. And the next one here is called Flywings 2016. Yeah, that sounds like a like a plan. Okay, so this is Flywings 2016. This seems to be more... Okay, so we can choose our plane here. Okay, so we're gonna have to go with the Boeing 747. Okay, so let's just click play here and see what happens. Okay, here we are. What is going on with the camera? So let's go max power here. Seems like we control this with the arrow keys. Okay, so how would you pull up? Arrow down? Okay, yeah, we're in there. Uh, do we have to fly in these things? I missed one. Okay, how do you retract your gear then? G again? 
yeah, okay. Flying a plane with a keyboard is certainly not recommended, because this, yeah, looks like our engines are smoking as well. Or maybe it's just like, I don't know. So here we can see our altitude, our speed and our heading. Also, the time, can we like speed it up? Okay, we actually can. Oh god, okay. Uh, this <laughs> flying a plane in four- oh no. What's going on? Um, so now we just gotta find a runway, I guess, to land on. I don't know where that is. Okay, let's just follow this signs here. Okay, so we're approaching this runway now at St. Martin. Okay, so we need to descend a bit here. We don't want to hit these mountains though. Uh, gear out. <laughs> bit too late, but yeah, sure. Why is it so like, it's swaying so much? Wow, I still have like full thrust. Can you put it like there? Oh, that's very quiet. Okay, so let's descend here. Careful, don't want to hit anything. Uh oh, more thrust. We're stalling. No, 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 please, 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 please. I just want to land. Oh man, now we gotta approach again. Let's not remove as much thrust. This should be okay. Let's do this and remove the thrust. Okay, not the reversers. Uh oh. Oh, no scare first. Come on. There we go. Mission completed. It's it's, it's kind of bouncy, but yeah. Uh, reverse thrust. There we go. Um, break. Oh. Wait, what? 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 It Okay, okay, that's weird. I didn't even click anything. All right. Uh, <laughs> all right. Okay. Well, let's uh, let's end that there and let's continue um, I think this is gonna be the last one though. Uh, let's see here flight arcade from Microsoft That sounds pretty good for demonstrating knowledge of basic flight principles start <laughs> Let's try to fly right through the middle. Oh wow. These controls are really sensitive as well. Oh, come on Can we hit it? There we go. Okay You did it I really did. You know what? I'm gonna try to land this plane instead, because flying in rings is very fun. So let's let's try to land it, because I've done that in every other game, so I think we should do that in this one as well. The runway is over there, uh, we don't want to over, over, overrun it. Why is it so laggy? Uh oh. Touchdown. I think you're getting the hang of this. Almost had it that time. <laughs> okay, I sure did. Are you ready to fly? No, I'm not ready to fly, I just want to land the plane. Okay, okay. This is the landing. Don't care about the runway. Let's just land right here without crashing, please. Why is it pulling up? No! Smooth and steady and... Okay, maybe you're not supposed to land and that's why it says crash every time. That that would make sense. Alright, let's just go ahead and pause this. Okay, I think that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. So yeah, this was my first time trying out any browser flight simulators. And it was actually like above my expectations because I didn't think it would even have like a 3D cockpit and stuff. That's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.